saying on the campaign stump, quote, I'd like to get rid of the IRS. I'd want to get rid of the income tax. Abolish it. That's a good idea. I like that idea. What would happen to all those lost revenues? How would we fund our government? Well, you have to cut spending. You can't get rid of the income tax if you don't get rid of some spending. But you know, if you got rid of the income tax today, you'd have about as much revenues as we had 10 years ago. And the size of government wasn't all that bad 10 years ago. So there's sources of revenues other than the income tax. You know, you have, uh, you have a tariff, excise taxes, user fees, uh, highway fees. So, so there's still a lot of money. But the real problem is spending. Uh, but, you know, we lived a long time in this country without an income tax. Up until 1913, we but didn't if, have it. But if you eliminate the income tax, do you know how much loss of revenue that would be? A lot. But, uh... Over a trillion dollars. Yeah, that's good. I mean, we, but we could save hundreds of billions of dollars if we had a sensible foreign policy. Well, I mean, if you're, if you're going to be the policeman of the world, you need that. You need the income tax to police the world and run the welfare state. I want a constitutional size government. Would you replace the income tax with anything else? Not if I could help it. You know, there are some proposals where probably almost anything would be, be a better than the income tax, but there's a lot of shortcomings with the, with the sales tax, but it would probably be slightly better, the income tax, so it, it would be an improvement. But the goal is to cut the spending, get back to a sensible size government. But if you had a flat tax, a 30% consumption tax, that would be very, very punishing to the poor and middle class. Oh, I know. That's why I don't want it. So I you'd have nothing. I want to cut spending. I want to get a use the Constitution as our guide and you wouldn't need the income tax.